Vascular access can be challenging in many surgical patients, especially those with obesity or history of intravenous drug abuse. Today, we will be demonstrating the use of ultrasound to facilitate venous access in the upper extremity. Here you see the patient's right arm after application of a tourniquet and skin preparation with betadine. A sterilely covered ultrasound probe is applied, applied to the arm proximal to the elbow joint and local anesthetic infiltrated adjacent to the ultrasound probe. The ultrasound image shows the brachial vein and brachial artery in transverse cross section with the brachial vein easily compressed by the ultrasound probe. The median nerve is also seen on the medial aspect of the brachial artery. Here we use a conventional intravenous catheter introduced perpendicular to the plane of imaging. We advance the catheter until the catheter is seen to cross the plane of imaging, immediately superficial to the brachial vein. Once the catheter is in close proximity and indenting the brachial vein, the catheter hub is inspected for a flash of venous blood return. Once this occurs, the probe is removed and the catheter advanced into the peripheral vein. The tourniquet is then removed and free flow to gravity confirmed with attached intravenous tubing and fluid. Because of the close proximity of the brachial artery and median nerve, caution is advised when performing this procedure. In most patients, the basilic vein is the preferred site of upper extremity venous access with ultrasound. However, this vein could not be identified in this patient.